welcome to another bread recipe. I know I'm obsessed with bread, but this one is only four ingredients this time and it's gluten free. It can be made vegan for all you beautiful plant based eaters out there. And you basically just throw all the ingredients. You don't need any yeast. You don't need to wait hours for it to rise. Nothing like that. Chuck all the ingredients, stir it, bake it. And there you have your beautiful high protein bread with at least 10 grams of protein per bread roll. So good, so nutritious and delicious. So if you're as excited as I am, make sure you hit that like button and also subscribe if you want to see more healthy recipes like this. And make sure you also connect with me on Instagram because I post a lot more healthy and fitness content there as well that you'll love. So without further ado, let's get into this recipe. So for this super healthy bread recipe, you are going to need some oat flour. Now this is made really easily by just blending rolled oats into a flour consistency using a blender or a food processor. It can take a couple of minutes or a couple of seconds depending on how powerful it is, but you just blend it until it's this powder smooth consistency. You'll need just under a teaspoon of salt. I'm using Himalayan pink salt because that's what I have on hand. And also two teaspoons of baking powder. This will help that heavy oat flour rise and make everything nice and fluffy. And of course, our high protein ingredient. So we are using vegan tofu, just classic tofu. I'm sure that silken or firm tofu would also work too. You just need to mash it using a fork. So it's kind of like a cottage cheese consistency. You can also use cottage cheese because that's really high in protein and low in fat as well. And you can also use non-fat Greek yogurt. If you're using the Greek yogurt or the cottage cheese, just, just make sure that you drain the liquid so it's just the thick part. And then I've also got some almond milk or you can also use egg whites just to brush the tops of these delicious bread buns and make it shiny. And then you can also use some optional seasoning. So I am using everything but the bagel seasoning, but I have made it myself and blended it because I live in Australia. So I actually don't have everything but the bagel seasoning, but I kept hearing Americans talking about it. And that's when I looked up for a recipe for it. I tried it and it's so delicious with so many things, especially on top of this bread recipe. It's so good. And let's get into this recipe. So I have preheated my oven to 190 degrees Celsius or 375 degrees Fahrenheit. And I'm just going to combine our dry ingredients. So I've got the one cup of oat flour. I'm gonna add that to the bowl. Just under a teaspoon of salt and the two teaspoons of baking powder. And I have grabbed my pretty gold spoon and I'm gonna give that a quick stir just until it's all nice and combined. Then I'm going to add our protein, which I am using the classic tofu, and I'm going to add that into our bowl and just give that a stir as well. Yeah, tofu is super good for you. It's really, really high in protein and it's a great source of iron, especially for plant-based eaters. I always make sure that I get a non-GMO organic tofu as well because Soybeans are one of the highest GMO foods in the world, so I do try and get the organic option wherever possible. And then just give that a stir until it starts to resemble a dough, which it will come together and you can kind of see that it comes together and like crumbles. It won't be like the most perfect dough, but it will end up a bit like Play-Doh texture, so keep an eye out for that. So now you can see that it is like a Play-Doh kind of texture and it's all nice and combined. So I'm going to form it into four sandwich buns. Onto a baking tray, which I am using a reusable mat. I highly recommend that you get yourself a reusable baking mat. It's so much more eco-friendly than using single-use baking paper. And you can grab yours off Nourish and Fiber.com. So I'm going to divide our dough into four equal portions, like so. Rolling it in my hand. And making sure that they're four equal portions so they cook. I also flatten them slightly so they kind of look like a bun. You can also make them into square shape if you want a traditional sandwich bread. 
but I'm just going to make mine into circles. It will probably look more like a burger bun, but either way, it's super delicious. So this is how the buns should look. And now this is totally optional, but I am going to do an almond milk wash. You can also use a whisked egg white wash as mentioned. So I just glaze the top like that and it's going to make that nice and shiny like real bread. <sighs> Making bread is honestly so therapeutic, plus knowing that it's a lot better for you makes it so much more satisfying. And then I just sprinkle our homemade everything but the bagel seasoning. You could also sprinkle it with just some sea salt, maybe some hemp seeds for extra protein and healthy fats. Anything that you desire. I know that I'm going to use my bread for savory purposes so that's why I'm using the delicious everything with the bagel seasoning. Yum! So good. Then I'm going to pop it into the oven for about 20 to 25 minutes until they're golden brown and they've risen beautifully. Or you can also put them into the air fryer at about 140 degrees Celsius for about 15 minutes. I know that air fryers are like all the rage so I thought that I would give it that option as well. It does make them crisp up really nicely, but they definitely are still beautiful from the oven. There we go. Now that that's done, we're going to pop that into the oven. So here is the finished result. They look absolutely delicious and my whole house smells amazing. So let's make a sandwich and do a taste test. Some guacamole, which I make by mashing avocado, lemon juice, some vegan chicken, some freshly sliced red onion. I've also got some vegan mayo. So delicious. Like bread. So now it's time for the ultimate taste test of our high protein vegan oat bread. Oh my god, I wish you could taste this, guys. It is delicious this bread is crusty and golden and crisp on the outside but nice and soft and chewy on the inside exactly like real bread you wouldn't know that there's tofu in this bread it is so good 10 grams of protein it's it's unreal try this guys mm. thank you so much for coming here and watching this video i love this bread and i really hope you try it so so good can't wait to go off camera and demolish this whole thing and if you did like this recipe i would love 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 again if you could like this video and comment below your thoughts i'd love to hear what you liked about this recipe don't forget also to subscribe if you want to see more healthy recipes and content like this Love to hear your thoughts. I look forward to hearing from you soon.